Reagan? Reagan. When he got shot in the yeah, shoulder? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I'm so what you, what'd you think when, when uh, Kennedy got shot? You were only... Uh, oh, I felt bad. That was uh, 30, 33 years ago, so you were in your 60s, right? Yeah, I was young. My daughter was alive yet. Yes. Your daughter was alive yet? Yeah. My daughter died in 1966. Of what? My mother bought you this book. Yeah. The President's book. Yeah. And when I was well, reading... you want to become president? No, no. I don't want to become a president. When I was reading this book... Yeah. I... Let me show you. Wait a minute. Sit back. Relax. Let me see. When you were born, 1901, right? Yeah. What happened? Who was in, who was in office? You mean the president? Who was in office? Do you remember? When I was born, how could I remember? My poor father and mother, they come. My mother was in his life. My father was here in America trying to get a job. He crossed the ocean four times. Four he times? Had, yeah, because he had, uh, what do you say, sweetheart? Pneumonia? No, not pneumonia. Maxima. No, not eczema. That's the stuff you buy. Yeah, but, you know, that. Um, a bad cold. Bad cold. And he had to cross the ocean. Right. And breathe that ocean air. That part saved him. So the last time he went to Italy, when he came back, I was here about, I don't know, about seven months, my mother came. Now this is my, this is my great-grandmother's great mother. And that's right. And they, and he come. I was born in 1901. Now where were you my born? My mother didn't know how to talk to me. Even before she died, she... She understood it. So you were first generation in America. That's right. You and my great grandmother. That's right. Were first no, generation. No, your grandmother was born in Italy. My great grandmother. Great. She was born in Italy. In Italy. I was born here. I was, my, my mother was not, of me about. Um, she came in October. I was born the following February. So how many months was she here before I came to the world? Uh, two months. She did a lot of talking, where she learned it, you know. And she left my niece, my sister Mary, in Italy, because she had something wrong with her head, and then she couldn't go on the boat. She was, uh, on that, the ship. that was her sister? That was her daughter that she left in Italy. That, that was, was my sister. Your sister was left in Italy? Yeah. You I never met her? No, she, no, she came. She, she came, came with friends, on. you know, with friends. And when she came knocking at the door at our house, I looked at her. She had a little shawl on her head. And I said to my mom, what, what the hell is that? She said, that's her sister. She was in Italy. She was sick when I come to her, you know. So I said, she got my sister. So they, they had to leave her on the hall. I wouldn't let her come in. Wow. And my sister Mary and I never got along with too good. Was she older than you or younger? She was older than me. She left her in Italy, I, you know. Now, what year did she die? Yeah, my sister Mary. Oh God, I don't know how long she did because I, I don't remember she died. Don't remember. Unless I look at those things. I have a big folio with all my people that passed away. Well, what's today's date? Today's February 9th? February the 9th. 1995. 95. Right. Okay. Now, so you were born here. In Poughkeepsie? On 7th Street, New York. No. Oh, in now New York. Oh, yes. What street? On 7th. That, now that's where all the bad people are. All the bad people are now. Yeah. So when you were born, when I was reading this book... Oh, dear God. The 25th... I'm going to die when? Let me just tell me when I'm going to die. I don't know me. when you're going to die. Who the hell knows? <laughs> William McKinley was in office. Do you recall that name? Mm, that sounds familiar to me. In 1901, yeah. he died. He died in Buffalo, New York. And this guy was it was the president. He was the 25th president. What president do you remember when you were in when you were in junior high or when you were in elementary school or high school? What was the the first president, the first president you started? Okay, before Roosevelt. Uh, Roosevelt was Hoover. Well, I was here, near the end, Hoover, 
And who was before Uber? Let me see. Uh, Franklin Roosevelt was during the Great Depression. I loved him. I Uber. loved him. I went to I went to Washington and tried to see him. Calvin Coolidge. You remember Coolidge? No. You don't remember him? He served from 23 to 29, 1923. You were 22 years old. I was married. Old. I was married. You were married what, ye what year? 1921. 1921. So when you got married, uh, Harding was in office. Warren Harding. Do you remember him? That name? Harding. He was the president of the United States back in 1921. But that's amazing, amazing though, that, that uh, when I was reading this, I said the, the first president I remember was Nixon. Because oh. that's the first one I could remember. I was only five years old. That's the first mm -hmm. one. Then Carter, then Reagan, Reagan, then Bush, and now Clinton. And what a wacko he is, you know? <laughs> but uh, I know. it's amazing. Yeah. This, I, I, I didn't, I didn't I'm think. getting sick and tired looking at the news. All I hear is about, uh, is that all about me and they, is he? Uh, in this book, mm. this was just the presidents. Oh, it's just the presidents. Just the presidents. Oh, I get it. And I, and you know. And how do you think of that thing they have very nice? Well, who, how long is this? Oh, O.J. Simpson? Yeah. How long is it going to be? Who, who's paying for all that? You, you are. Got? Taxpayers. That's why they raised my rent. That's why they raised my they take a 200 and something out of my social security, section 8. But they give me my nurse and anyway, my doctor, you know. Well, I don't yeah, O.J. Simpson, he's nice about that. He wants you to have your medicine. Oh, yes. Yeah, so. What do you think of this president? Clinton? Yeah, yeah. I didn't vote for him. Who'd you vote for? I was going to die. I was for God now. Did you vote? I didn't float across. I vote with a... No, oh, I wanted to vote for. Who did you vote for? Bush? Bush, I think. I don't know. I, I didn't vote for him. Who was the first president you voted for? Truman? Who? Truman. Harry Truman? Truman. Harry Truman. He was the first one you voted oh, for. I think I, I, when I was downtown, when I was downtown with my people, I voted down in the, in the Cadillac Firehouse. I used to go with them and vote. Yeah. I was single, you know. Who was the first one you voted for? Yeah, I can't remember, sweetheart. I can't remember, darling. Do you remember when uh, Kennedy got shot? Yes. Oh, yes, I saw. How did you feel about that? Oh, my God. I thought he was gone. He was, he was gone. gone. He, he died. He was shot. No, oh, that's the president. And when he was... And you know, Kennedy, Kennedy. Oh, I'm thinking about that other one. That was shot. Oh, so, Reagan? Reagan. When he got shot in the yeah, shoulder? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I so what you, would you think when when uh, Kennedy got shot? You were only um, oh I felt so bad. That was uh, 30, 33 years ago. So you were in your sixties, right? Yeah, I was young. My daughter was alive yet. Yes. Your daughter was alive yet. Yeah. My daughter died in nineteen sixty six. Of what? Nineteen sixty six. What year? No, no, nineteen sixty six. She died. But what did she die of? I used to mention it's for fucking cancer. Oh, cancer. Yeah. yeah, that cancer can kill you, huh? Oh. It's a bad disease. Oh, it was bad. It was went through hell. But her husband, she had one good husband. She had one good husband. He did everything for her. There he was did. nothing in this world that that man didn't do for my daughter. Really? A good man, huh? A fine man like that, going through what he did. Screaming, screaming at night, and then I had a hold of the little girl. She hung down me, Grandma. Why is mommy crying? Where's mommy? Where's mommy? Where's mommy going? Oh, I went through hell. Nobody really? knows. Nobody knows. No, I sit no. here now, and I think of those things. All right, I don't cry in front of people. I don't cry. Sometimes I cry to Angie, because you know that's the only one I could cry to. But she's giving me help. But I get help when I cry by myself. When I'm alone, I say yeah. my prayers. And that's it. Wow. That's that's amazing. You know? It's no good to get old. No good, Dolly. No to good? Get up and, oh, sir. Well, you might have 50 more years. Who oh, stop know? that, Dolly. Stop that. You don't know. No. When God takes you, he takes no, you. No, I don't know. I went to the doctor. My heart is all right. My blood pressure is all right. 
101 pounds. Yeah. I lose my lose and weight every time I go to. Mm. But I use what, what I want. I don't want no more. I can't eat. I can't force it down. No, I, don't I, force I, it down. I'll, 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 I'll chuck it, sure. Yeah. Don't force it down. No, no. I said that to Angelo. Angelo said, oh, try it. No, I said. My father's a pain in the ass, isn't oh, he? Oh, God. I wish what the name is here when he comes in. He's my gross. He makes our text from uh, the sister, Dorothy. Uh, my Aunt Dorothy, right. uh, Believe me, she, she tell him. He's a pain in the ass, huh? I gotta have an awful time with their father. He Sometimes he's good. Oh my lord, you wouldn't oh, want yeah. a better man. Really? You wouldn't want a better man. Oh, but sometimes he gets me so nervous. What does he do to get you nervous? <laughs> he yells at you, right? Yeah. Why do you put this together? Why do you have it ready? I don't know. I can't see very good. I say, Angelo, I, I try. When I got money for him, I got more money. Sometimes I got less because I don't put it straight you know, all together, you know. So. He's like an old lady. He's worse than me. <laughs> at least, he, at least I, I'm asking him, and he's young. He's got to help me, but That's I have nice. to help him. Jeez. What does one think about him? One time I gave him more money. He called me on the phone. You, you gave him the wrong money? I gave him about $40 more. Oh, you did? Oh. And what did he do with I wouldn't know if it's $40. I wouldn't know. What did he do? He called me up right away. I got I got $40. I got to give him back. You gave me forty dollars too much. I need a new car yourself, I said. Now you know what I do? Oh, he's honest. I make hundred dollar bill and fifty dollar bills. So what I do. I don't have to come. You know? Right. Who so I get him like that, and, and I, I I give it to him that way. So my my um my great grandmother was older than you. My you mean my. Your sister. My sister. She, big mom. She was a big mom. She was the oldest one. No, she was my the brother. Wait a minute. No, she was the oldest of my brother. I think. How many kids in the Morbido family? How many kids? Not the Morbido. My 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 grandmother's mother's maiden name was what? Yeah, grandmother. Your 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 maiden name. Make your mother. Your mother's your grandmother. You 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 great that Angela was great. That's a her great son. Angie's mother was my sister. Right. She's your aunt. Right. That's so. No, no. That's Grandma Polito. Yeah. Her mother, mother was my sister. Your sister. Yes. And 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 she was a Morbido. My oh. grandmother was a Morbido. Oh yes. Okay. But uh, Big Mama's maiden name was Mancuso. That's right. Okay. Now, was Big Mama older than you? Oh, my God, yes. She was. I'm, I'm 94. Would it would be 94. She would have been 100 and something. What type of woman was she? Oh, I loved her. She was the oldest out of how many kids? Angie, Dominic, Anthony. Yeah. Oh, oh, didn't she? And Jenny. She had two boys and two girls, I think, didn't she? Yeah. Two boys. No, three boys. How many? And you had three brothers? For me? No, I had one brother. You had one brother. And four sisters. And four That's sisters. Yes. And one of the sisters was my great grandmother. That's right. She was the oldest. Oh, she was over me. I see. Strong woman. Oh yes. She won't put up with no shit. For a man, for a woman that didn't know how to read and write, she got she got around. Really? Drive a car, go to the yard, go here, go there. I always went with her. I wasn't afraid. Really? I did. I back and forth to New York. We had good times. What are you doing in New York? You drinking, meet people? Yeah, we, we, it's nothing's were there. You know. But well, they all died away. I, yeah. I, I, I got nobody. I left alone. <laughs> all I got is you people. That's right. That's all. Now, when when you went to New York City, what did you do? You drank. What was your drink? Oh, what was, yeah. What was her? One night, Angie and Angie and Angie. The day she was my baby sister. Her and Rose, the other sister, that died away not long ago. Well, we 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 didn't ask her about us. 
We went out. We went to get on the parade. We had a wonderful time. We so pleased we dragged met men, you know. We had a good time. And when we came all home, I just, Betty, she called us names. She was very names. angry? She was mad at us. Why? Because we didn't take her with us. How old was she at the well, time? She, she was about, how old was my children? My sister Betty was to me. She must have been. She was 75 when she died, 74, I don't know, sweetheart. But she was young, right? Oh, she was a beautiful So how, she, how could she come with you if she was young? She, she was, was allowed a, to go into the bars? She was though. She was, oh, yeah. She, she Anybody was could go into the bars at that time, right? Oh, it was nice. It was nice. We didn't find no bad guys or, you know. None of that crap. They, no, no, you wouldn't find it. Well, I was driving. Oh, after that, well, Joe passed away. I was going home to my house while the window's wide open, stop at corners. I see people at uh, 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. I was alone. But today you can't do that. Even if I could drive today, I couldn't go out 2, 3 o'clock in the morning and leave my door unlocked. No way. I was what's his name when I come along and taking me home. Uh, Mary Ann's husband was uh, her second <laughs> husband. What was his name? Ray. Ray. He took brought me home. We stopped at the light, and some color man came knocking on his window. What color? Black. He was black. No. <laughs> so, so I looked at don't, don't bother. I said, Ray, don't open the window, Ray, don't open. No, I'm not going to open. He said, well, are you going to call me to me? And he said, no. And I wasn't praying to God, come on, please, the light. Pass the light, I'll pay $50. Pass the light, I said, Ray. I really? So scared. You're scared, huh? I was scared. Wow. Well, what, when you went to the city, what was your favorite drink? What did you always use to drink? Beer. Beer. All the time. What type of beer? Well, what was type they had? Genesee, Schaefer. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. That was your beer. Well, I went to Florida, Bob, with my niece and Jen, to go see Vicky. Oh, yeah, about 12, 14 years ago. To go see Vicky in Florida? Vicky in Florida. I'll never go again. As long as I did. Why? You don't like her? Yeah, I'm scared. First place I'm scared of them. Because I was shaking like me. I had my rosary in my hand. And like he said to me, Hey, Joe, sit by the window and see the sky. Who the hell wants to see the sky? I said to her, Let me be. Leave me alone. And then there were real drinking. I got a drink. You know. Drank. Yeah. I drank a high water. Well, no. Sometimes. Were you drunk? Like yeah. So when, we, when I got there, I was, we went out one night. And they should think that he took us out. They went to this place where they dance and drink, you know? And, and, and Vicky knows the man. He knew, she knew the bartender. So I sat in the corner of the bar. I didn't want to dance, you know. I, I didn't feel up to it. And Vicky and Nancy were dancing with different ones, you know. But I didn't. I said, no, I was drinking beer. And every time I, my glass was empty, this man, you want another one? I say yes. So I thought whether he was paying for it, I was paying for it. I didn't care, because I liked that beer. So after we just before we come home, he called Vicky over to the bar. He said, Vicky, I've served a lot of women beer, and they drank a lot of beer, but nothing like your aunt. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was really a wheel to get up from this chair. I was scared stiff. I got up. No problem. With, no problem. You drove? What? No. Vicky. You were drunk. No. no, I didn't feel it. <laughs> but I don't think I said to her that I drank a lot of beer. He said, I've served women a lot of beer, but not like I served your aunt. How many beers could you possibly drink? Oh, the glass. I would say maybe I had about 12. But I sit there and talking to him. Talking, you know, yeah. Look at them, they have and, to and dance, they come over and talk to me. You know, I didn't stay at still or anything. But you were trying. I with your grand, great, what do you call my sister, your great, great grandma? Right. We went used to, I don't know whether you know or not, we used to go on Delaney Street where the scores and them used to live. Right. And she used to make this home whiskey. Terrible, but really? I drank it. You drank it. Your my grandmother and I had a hell of a time. So we went down Delphi's right across the church where the Italian churches. There's a, there was a gentleman, a contractor, he was a very nice man, we had to see him. So coming down, I had to go to the bathroom, I was ashamed to ask the man, I wanted to use his bathroom. So we came 
it out, and I, I spoke on terrible, and there was a dog, a dog, at that hour, 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock in the morning, barking, barking. So I squatted down, and I, I ran. I, I ran. I said, oh, geez, I gotta go, I can't go. And he kept saying, right in front, like you under me. Whoa, 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 whoa. And I was doing the same thing. Whoa, 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 <laughs> to him. My sister, my sister looked at me, what are you doing? I said, hey, let's see, I have to have it. It's so bad, I can't help. My pants, my slip, my slip. I, I wore dresses then. Then I didn't know never wore slacks, you know. Gee. Anyway, as I say, well, we had a hell of a time. Really? Those were the times oh, back then, huh? Well, I sit here and think of those things. And I said, so I shouldn't, I don't regret that I got no money, that I got no more fun, that I go, don't go nowhere. It doesn't bother me. I have my, nothing to regret. That's why I said my husband took me all over. I seen everything. You seen that everything? I see. Yeah. So they walked. He was sick and then he got his stroke. I said, oh, well, if anything gets better, look, 50 years, four more months, I would really have been married, 50 years married. He was going to take me on a cruise. But really? I never got the cruise. So there you are. What did he do for a living, your husband? Well, he had a good job. First he owned the place on College Street, but when the IBM took that part of uh, the war, these little tubes that you put in ships and radio and things like that, the IBM stole that compact that thing. And they took over until they, he didn't have the IBM anymore. Because they used to buy an awful lot from them, you know. So then he had to go work for some, you know, business people. And when he laid in the hospital for four months with a stroke, these people he worked for, I always got the check every week. They sent me the check. I got the check. They had to pitch away. I didn't get it anymore. So wow. I, got a, I, I have no regrets about Ali, uh, but. That, what I mean, when sometimes they say, maybe if I had a little money today, what would I do? I can't go nowhere. Can I? Unless I, I take a nurse, if I was rich, rich, I take a nurse in, with me on a trip. Right. Because I can't go alone. Right. And I can't go with this girl that takes care of me an hour here. She comes an hour a day? That, no, two hours. Two hours a day? Yeah. What does she do? Well, she washes and cleans my home. She washes and bought and puts the stuff on me. She washes my hair, she curls my hair. She does everything for me. And where did you but find they, her? They sent me this this is that's why they're taking a hundred and they were taking a hundred and seventy dollars out of my check as soon as I reach, before I receive it. Now it's a hundred and eighty three. It's going up. Yeah. And they raised rate ten dollars. I was paying a hundred and seventy three, now I gotta pay ten dollars more on eighty three. So my rent and my social and uh, this is taking the raise I get, I got from the check. Wow. So that's what I say, one thing you ready after another. One thing after another, huh? So getting back in, let's say back in 1932, the Great Depression, what was your husband doing? He was working down the South Road, you know, where that, uh, they sell bricks and for houses, blocks for houses and cement and all that. Was he feeling the depression? Were you? Oh yeah, he wasn't getting much. Nothing. How did everybody survive? I don't know, sweetheart. That's why I say. Now, 1930. Oh, I had a big We had a big insurance. We borrowed some insurance. Now I'm paying it back so I can get buried in style. In style, huh? As your father says. What do you want, Aunt Joe? Hey, as long as you, be, you people bury me with my husband, That's it. I don't care, nothing else. And That's I got good. plenty of that too. So I don't have to ask all my nieces and nephews to chip in to bury me. Right. That's one thing I don't want to do. I want my own money to bury me. That's right. I got it. That's right. And you'll be all taken care of. Now, in 1932, Grandma Polito and Grandpa Polito got married. 1932. You were in the wedding? Oh, yes. Oh, you have a yes. good time that day? Oh, God. I was drinking beer and that and my own, Uncle Joe and everybody. We yeah? Were a hell of a, a lot time. of fun, huh? Oh, yes. That. No mad. Nobody's mad. Nobody. 
like it is now. You don't know who, who's mad at each other. I don't like it. You know, I'm getting so bad, I don't pay no attention anymore. No more. No more. Yeah, every, everybody's mad at this but, one, so, that one. Yeah. You know, what, what, what is it? You can't live forever, sweetheart. Yeah. I'm sure, pray to God, to take me. Because what am I got to do? All right, but if these young people stay like you, my niece Jenny, your, your aunt, Jen, Angie, and all them, say, be happy. Get, stay together. Go visit one another. Because as I pray, I listen to, pray, to the Mass every day, and it's a Mass, I appreciate it, such beautiful things. If they only listen to him, maybe they'd be all right. But I, I called your aunt today. She don't call me. She never calls me. And Angie? No, her, every night I talk to Angie. Jenny, she's sick. Everybody's sick as far as I go. Her husband's sick. She what? I don't go no place. All I go is Here's me now her story. She goes, just shopping back again. Now listen, if she drives a car and goes shopping, she can come and get me and bring me to the house and have a little talk together. I'm not asking her, uh, you know, anything. But I never mentioned it to her. Because I feel this way. If she drives and goes by grocery, pays the bills, and I thought, I said to myself, oh, money with her money. Why she pays bills? Because we're going to her pay her bills. Why doesn't she mess her checks? Right. I don't understand nothing anymore. The older I get, the dumber I'm getting. No, I am. no, 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 you're not getting dumber. I'm getting you're, dumber. I, I can understand what you're doing. I, I mean, I, I write checks out. I don't have to go to this no, one, go to that, not that one. one. No. Hey, she likes to drive. But I knows? never made a check in all my life. Really? Uncle Joe took care of everything. Everything. I don't know what to, the, how to make a check. I watch her, your, your father. I watch Dominic, how he writes down. I said, and then he writes it on the other book. I couldn't do that today. I couldn't. Mm. Yeah, yeah. I can't do that today either myself. Too many freaking numbers. That's right. I get numbers. all confused. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not, yeah, I don't do it like that. I said, the thing I don't have to sign them. I don't sign them. You got to get a stamp with your name. And Joe O'Hare. And yeah, you stamp all the checks. That. I go by number. I go by a number. I don't know what they do there. What do they want to do? I don't care. I don't care. Now, when you drank, mm -hmm. did Uncle Joe drink a lot too? Yeah, not, you know, sometimes when he felt it, he made me drive. As long as I was. My car drove me home. <laughs> as drunk as you were. Yeah. My you drunk. Car went straight. straight as a line. Right a line. You like think an like arrow. It was a, you think it was a person? Yeah. Well, first of all, we so you know, drank and drive. You drunk? Oh my God, yes. Oh my God. I used to go with down to Battle Sony's, down to Bootsy's. I used to go all over and play cards or something. You always yeah. drank and drove. Yeah, drunk. Yeah. I drove for 38 years. Drunk. Well, when I used to go to my niece, my daughter never drank. No, no. But no. most of the time you're drunk. Yes. And <laughs> you never got an accident. Never got that. I was still here. I said to myself, they used to say to me, you go now, what is that disease you get and you die with it before you be in a drunk and drinking so much? Uh, funds are low. Funds are low. The what? Funds are low disease. It means funds are low. Your money. <laughs> <laughs> That's the disease everybody's got. Oh, I'm telling you. But today you can't do it. Today the, everything is high and, you know. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's, 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 it's a different world today. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Now, you're going to tell me, what work are you doing now? What we'll work? Well, I'm in the process. Of a pizza, you say? I want to do a pizzeria very badly. Oh, yeah, because there's a lot of money in there. A lot of money, yeah, a lot of money, and um, it's fun. It's fun. You're being with the, the public, you know. I should have got into politics. That's right. I, I like that, you know. I like being with yeah, people, and yeah, I like to. Yeah, yeah. I like to work for me. I don't want to work for anybody oh, I else. Oh, yeah, that's good. You know, I don't want to work for anybody. And how how can you go? How can you do that? How can you get do that? How do you go around? How do you go around? I don't know. I need the uh, I need the, a lot of scaro, you know. I need uh, a little bit of money. And your father can't help you. Well, I, I don't, I don't, I think if he could, he would. But what I'm doing right now is learning the business. I'm learning oh. how to do it. Learning, 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 learning about a lot of different people, you know. And where is this? Where is this pie you, pizzeria you work? <clears throat> Tony's Pizza Pit. Where is that? 
right by uh, Raymond Avenue, across from Holy Trinity, right in the city of Poughkeepsie, almost the town. Across from Holy Trinity. So I was after there. I've been in the Main Street in 10 years. Right off the arterial. Mm -hmm. Can't miss it. I work there. I work at another friend's place. I work at another friend's place. I work at three or four pizzerias. But do you get paid? Yeah, I get paid. Not too much. Yeah. You know, a little bit. And you don't have to, you're home. I'm your living home. at home still, yes. Yes, you haven't got your father to pay rent yourself. No, I, remember when I did move out? I moved out in Pleasant Valley for two, two, three months. Then I moved back home. Mm. Yeah. I didn't, I was working at the hospital at the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was working at the hospital. I didn't. I didn't care for that too much. No. Too too many sad stories. Oh, what? Right. How about a nice cold beer? I don't drink beer. What do you drink? I don't. I don't. Wine, no. scotch and soda. What do you want? Uh, no, I don't. I. I really don't drink anything. Yeah, I'm not thirsty. Uh, I don't. I want to be the first one to give you a drink. If you don't drink, don't drink. That's it. I don't drink. So. Um, so what else is new? You, you relax, you have a good time, you watch the TV here? Well, I, I put that on because I knew you was coming. I want to make sure it's him. Right, you, you saw know. me with my hat Yes, on. yes, yes. I don't want to catch a cold. No, know. I don't blame you. You know me with football. Look at all the football stuff I got. See the Will jacket? you please tell me what that thing is doing? That's got me nervous. Oh, I'm sorry. I was just warming up the battery in it. Oh, you're re recharging yeah, it. Yeah. Oh, all right, daddy. I'm sorry, I don't want you to get that, that nervous. Don't get nervous over no, that. No, I was wondering what that was. I was <laughs> like, where's he got that? Oh, damn. So, you know, so when I was reading this book, I, I liked it. I really do. Little Michael wanted this. Michael? Little Michael. He's going to be Is nine. He, He's going to he be... Read and he, 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 he thought it was very interesting when he saw it. But he reads the words and everything. Uh, I think he would like it. I, I think he would like to read it. You know, but he can't read it yet. I don't think he can read the the language right now. The baby, Dalton's baby's not christened yet, is it? Uh, Lisa's baby. I mean, it's all right. It's all right. Lisa's yeah. Lisa's baby is um, big baby now, no? Big, yeah. He's about four feet tall now. <laughs> he's thirteen inches long. I just got off the phone with her a little while ago. He's 13 inches long. He just got his shot today. Oh. So he's, uh, he was crying. You know, he's going to be sore. So um, he grew five inches since he was born. Five inches. I know. He's going to be a tall guy. He's going to be a good looking man. His father's not tall anyway. No, his father's short. Short, I know yeah. he was. But the, he's going to be a good looking guy. I bet. You know? I bet. I bet. Well, she's not bad looking. And I think Ed is, what is his name? Kenny. Kenny. I don't think he's bad-looking. No, he's you know, a good-looking guy. Yeah, I don't think, no. He's nice. Yeah, we don't care what anybody says. He's a good-looking guy. <laughs> no, they can't say nothing about that. No, he's no. a good man. Oh, yeah, he's... You know, I always liked Dorothy. I always liked Dorothy. Yeah. Dorothy was nice. Yeah. Yeah. Lisa. Lisa. I got Dorothy on my mind. I don't know well, Lisa and Aunt Dorothy resembles. They resemble yeah. one another. Yeah. They're both nuts. And, and Dorothy, what happened ever since she started? Is she married to this boy? I mean, you know, I, I, I don't know, to be honest with you. My God, sweetheart, I don't know. Change. Things are so changed. So many things change. Oh. I know, Aunt Joe. I that, know. Isn't, you know. People isn't, don't work out things no, no more. No, no, no. They, they Go. end it. One, Go two, once three. More. Yeah. Look at my parents. You know, they broke up. They're together. They break oh, up. Oh, I'm glad they're together. Well, I have fun with them. Well, once in a while we go out together for lunch, and we have fun. I have fun with them. Yeah, I have fun with them. Yeah. My mother's funny, isn't she? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> whether she, she's sad or whether she's mad, she can, she says something funny. Yeah, regardless. Regardless, regardless. She regardless. gets, she gets underneath my father's skin. She gets underneath his skin. <laughs> know what's the matter with your father. He talks so loud. I think my neighbors think that he's fighting with me. He talks so fast. Oh. Well, you tell him when he starts yelling. Well, when I tell him not to buy stuff, he buys me hamburger. I don't want no more hamburger. 
I don't want them all there, but I'm having my tea to see that on hooks. And they pop up if I have some, you know what I mean. And I paid so much money for them. The set I got down below here was $300. The one up here, the, just the one, $200. I'm paying an awful lot of money for them just to keep a few teeth that I even pull them out. Jeez. No, he said, well, if you want them pulled, go to another dentist. But well, I those are your teeth. Dead. Well, oh, yeah, mine. Oh, these, what I got here, they're false. The one that I got on hooks, they're false. Because they couldn't do nothing with them. He couldn't save them. Well, why does he buy a hamburger meat if he can't eat it? Oh, he gets some out. I, I was going to throw away, but Gracie down the hall here. She made me balls for me. She fixed balls. balls. That's good. You drink a lot of water, huh? Mm -hmm. Drink a lot of water? I I drink a gallon of water a week. A gallon of water a week? Maybe sometimes more. I, I, That's I almost drink. a glass a day. Mm -hmm. Oh, I eat drink more than two glasses. Really? Yeah, it must be all. That's good, Aunt Joe. That's very good. And I, 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 he asked me, I said, why, oh, it's a way, I said, do you, when, eat in between, he said, eat a little each, you know, every few minutes, hours or so, keep you, I'm not hungry. Now I had a, two meatball, just a spaghetti, a piece of pizza, oh, my great, my grandson's wife was here last night, they brought a piece of pizza, it was delicious, but, got uh, got anchovies. It really? Wasn't, oh, I enjoyed it. Pizza. She brought me just a little container, and they brought a bigger you container. You like pizza? I love pizza from uh, what you call it. I eat your own grandmother, great grandma. She makes nice meat, but I don't be nobody else's. And I haven't had it in a long, long, long time. So now I, I, they went to, what's the name? Hut? Pizza Hut. Pizza Hut. And they brought a container, a box of uh, chicken wings, chicken wings with sauce, but I didn't taste it. I didn't want to see chicken because I got chicken all the time. And then they bought me a little pizza. And I had half it last night. And half, beside my meatballs and my spaghetti, I had half the pizza, so I did pretty good. That's very good. So now, in a little while, maybe I'll have a cookie or something. Tonight I'll have a little soup. I have this, these containers of soup. With little I want to ask you not to change the subject, but I want to ask you, where did you attend uh, your elementary school? Where did you go to? Elsewhere, down Pine Street. In Pine Street, and here. Uh, in Pine I, Street? Didn't, you, I didn't go. I, I left in the sixth grade. You left in the sixth grade. Yeah, I left in the sixth grade. I can't write anymore. Well, that's all right. I left in the sixth grade. You left in the sixth grade. I can't write anymore. I used to be very good, but now I can't do it anymore. You I can't spell right. You never graduated. No, I never made the grades. Really? Oh, You're probably too drunk. I wasn't drinking when I was going to school. <laughs> oh, God, no. So you left in sixth grade. Yeah. Then what did you do after sixth grade? I was 13. I went to got working. Working? In fact, eight years. Factory for eight years. And I met a, there used to be a student here. There used to be a lot of Spanish boys. And there was one old boy, he was good looking. And I used to go to work. The factory was about, oh, about three blocks away from where the, the college was, where these students were. And this one night, I met him at the dance. At the dance? Yeah. I didn't keep looking at him, but I was afraid of him. I was, you know, I, I didn't know him. I knew all of the gypsy men. I used to, the gypsy fellows, I used to dance with them. So, what's his name? Frank Ross, uh, Tommy. I used to there's some people I knew. So um, this one, and he stood outside when I came out. And I was supposed to come home at 11 o'clock because I told him I was going, I told my people I was going to movies. So you lied. Until 11 o'clock. I was going to. So you lied. I li oh, yes. Did you lie a well, lot? Oh, I had to lie with my father and mother, otherwise I couldn't go to dances. I used to go to dances all the time. And they didn't know this. No. My mother once in a while I would tell her that. It was one of them. So anyway, I, I, I went to, he went outside. He said, can I take you home? I said, no. I said, I got, 
I don't know, I'll be all right. I I've got I've got far to go. I said, and he followed me. You know, on the corner of June, uh, Mill Street, where Tassone's funeral parlor is, right on the corner there, there used to be a Jewish church. I don't know whether it's still there or not. Jewish community yeah, center. Yeah, yeah. Still there. And I stopped right there still. And you know, he stood there. And the other said to him, why don't you make a day? I'd like to make a day with you. So I said, you know, maybe I can get rid of him. Yeah, I said, yes. So he made a day with me. I said, uh, I don't know what time I'll get out. Where do you, you know, I'll, I go to college. Where's the college? What's the name of your college? Holt. That was the name of a factory. <laughs> you told him that the fact that the college was the... I told him the fact, the fact that I was working, making uh, man's pants, was a, a college. And I said, the name of it's Holt. By heck, if he didn't come in front of Holt. There he was in front of the, the factory. The factory. <laughs> and he thought it was the college. Well, we've been coming out, you know, man. And then, oh my. Oh, I said, so I had to tell him the truth. And what did he so say? I said, you know, but he got fresh. He did? And I let go. I never saw that man again. Really? Never. So uh, Uncle Joe used to live on Mill Street. You know where uh, Cafe Or is? Cafe Or. About two, three blocks, uh, two, three houses above there. Right. Before they made that Charles place where all those houses are. Right. He lived there with his mother and father. He was the only child. And he used to go to, he used to work on the railroad. And he used to pass me every morning, me going to work. And. Uh, you used to walk, right? I walk to Holland's. So one morning, I was trying to fix my skirt, you know? And as I was there, he came and took my arm. I thought my skirt was going to fall. I said, he said, excuse me. I said, no lie. I said, watch where you're going. And he said, I wasn't going to say. And I looked at him, I said, he's not bad looking, you know? And you told him, watch where you're going, pal. Yeah, watch your, yeah, I said, watch where you're going, you know? And I was trying to fix my skirt. Because I, I used to be always late to go to work. You really did? And I never got my bonus, because if you get there on time, I used to get a bonus. And I, I used to just keep the bonus. But my father one day noticed that I scratched it, I raised it. He said, you got more money than this. He used to take the money from you? Oh, my mommy, I don't think he's like you now. Not like that. It happened in my days. No. If I did, I'd have a little money of my own. So all the money you made went to your father? Went to your father. But my father kept me. And clothes, wonderful, you know, whatever I wanted, my father bought for me and for the other two sisters of mine. So, he hit I, your arm, I, right? I, I, and then, so, yeah, so, this one morning I was walking, you know, and he walked, he said, how's, what, how's it get a chance to make it a day for you? Can I see it tonight? And I looked up at him and he's so tall, yeah, you know, he was tall. I was, he had reddish hair. Yeah, all right. Call me. I told him to call me. Somebody called me. So I told him, that that's who he is. My mom and grandma said, well, it's N Nellie. She's doing up the street. She wants to go to the movies. So you're 21 at this time. Oh, no. I'm about 17. 17. Yeah. So we used to, I never told my mother I went with a man until after a while. I went with a been a year before I told my people. But he was a gentleman. He was very, very nice. very nice to me. He used to hug me and kiss me, but he never, never talked fresh or did fresh, you know. So we, the we kept going. So when I said, I decided, I said, oh, no, change. Things are so changed. So many things change. Oh, I know, Aunt Joe. I that, know. It isn't, you know. People don't work out things no, no more. No, no, no. They, they go. End it. One, two, three. Yeah. Look at my parents. You know, they broke up. They're together. They break oh, up. Oh, I'm glad they're together. Well, I have fun with them. We'll, we, once in a while, we go out together for lunch. And we have fun. I have fun with them. Yeah, I have fun with them. Yeah.